Everybody loves the Cocker Spaniel, and why would they not? These cute and cuddly dogs have not only been good-natured for many centuries, but have also been known to be active sporting dogs that were used as working hunting dogs for many years, showing that this adorable pet isn't all about its looks. Plus, due to their physical conditions and temperament, there are many things owners do to ruin their experience with a well-balanced dog. So if you're looking to bring one into your home, there are certain things you must avoid in order to make sure it remains the perfect pet for you and your family. Want to find out what these things are? Here are the 5 things to never do to your Cocker Spaniel. Number 5. Ignore Grooming We begin this list with something that is obvious to those looking at the sturdy and compact medium-sized dog, grooming. One of the main selling points of the Cocker Spaniel is its long-haired beautiful coat. But with that comes the responsibility of grooming the Cocker Spaniel often. A Cocker Spaniel owner should just get used to the fact that they will be on a first-name basis with their dog's groomer and there's nothing to debate about it. Before we continue, make sure to check the links in the description. We found the best deals for online dog training, dog supplies, pet insurance, and more. What are you waiting for? Not only would you need to brush its coat daily, but you should also seek out a groomer every six to eight weeks in order to keep your pet's coat free from knots and tangles. So always keep that in mind. Number four, never exercising. Like any other working dog, this breed requires a lot of exercise and physical activity. Thus, it is very necessary to maintain their compact and athletic physique. Moreover, this will stop your pet from finding other mischievous outlets for its energy, like chewing on furniture or on your shoes. So you should take them for two 20-minute walks every day. So better get those trainers out, folks. Time to get that workout done. Number three, never visiting the vet. Like any human or any other pet you might know or own, regular medical checkups are an absolute necessity. Although they are known to be a healthy and vivacious breed, the Cocker Spaniel is susceptible to a number of skin allergies, as well as some issues with their eyes and ears, such as cataracts and deafness. They are also known to be prone to other diseases, such as hip dysplasia and heart murmurs. Even worse, it's known that one of the leading causes of their deaths is cancer. Thus, it's important to take your Cocker Spaniel for regular checkups with your vet if you want to keep it healthy for 12 to 15 years of its lifespan. Number two, never leave them unsupervised with kids. Socializing your Cocker is just as important as socializing any other breed, if not more. In fact, it's especially important to make sure you socialize your Cocker puppy properly before leaving them unsupervised, especially with children. Cocker Spaniels are known to be a sensitive breed and they pick up behavioral characteristics from those around them. Leaving them with vibrant and active children might be too much for them, and this might lead to negative behavior such as nipping and full-on biting. It's important to be around when they're with children in order to curb this behavior while they are developing. That way, they won't develop into shy or nervous pets. Number 1. Never yell at them Finally, we must remember what we said about cues. Always remember to be patient with them. Yelling at your Cocker Spaniel will make it believe that this behavior is okay to the point where it will lash out at you and others when it sees fit. This is apparently one of the reasons they are given away in that they develop an aggressive mentality. So soft but firm is the way to go for your pooch. With that, our video has come to an end here. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more pets and dog related content. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Until then, goodbye.